My name is Dr. Michael Abedin, and the question has come up, how do you select patients for the hired suspension and uh, looking for hypopharyngeal collapse? So everybody's going to scope a patient with uh, an evaluation of sleep apnea. So what we'll do is we'll place this in his nose, and then what I gently do is put pressure directly on the hyoid bone. And what you'll learn over time is if they collapse with light pressure, specifically in anterior to posterior direction, then they're very likely to respond to the hyoid suspension. So here we go. So here we go. <clears throat> this is not just for retroflexed uh, epiglottis. If you can see, this patient does not have sleep apnea. And I'm pushing really hard. And, uh, I can barely block his airway. Okay, so we're trying to make it straight forward and I'm pushing very lightly. I'm gonna check with the meter here in just a minute. And that's like 0.3. When I pushed it 0.7, it's like there, then he's completely blocked up, okay?